Hey guys, this is Diane with 303 High Priestess. This is a reading for Virgo. This is going to be from May 24th through the 31st. We're going to look at love first, then we're going to go into career, okay? Let me pull one card for each and see what message this universe has for you, okay? Spirit and angel guys are the most high place. Give me the cards for Virgo. Give me one card for Virgo and love first. What message do you have? Four, five Virgos. Thank you. All right. Ooh, you guys are always deep. Deep, 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 deep. Okay. So let's see what you have in career here. What message do you have for Virgo in career? What would you like them to know? May 24th through the 31st. There we go. All right. So that's already flipped over visions of life beyond death here virgo okay i told you that was kind of deep look at that it's really pretty though so visions of life beyond death a sacred terrain beyond logic and convention acts god universe the source Okay, whatever you call them, to show you the most helpful way to see the situation or concern now. Whatever you're dealing with, whatever obstacle you're faced with, ask for help, okay? Um, ask to be shown the most helpful way to see the situation, okay? That's how you really get the answers that you're looking for i feel like you're being asked to look at something through the eyes of love rather than fear you're being told that this can help you find your way quickly okay through the eyes of love and not fear so Something you guys are battling with here in love. A question you are conflicted with. And I feel like you guys are thinking about it. You're praying about it. You are. It's really on your mind here, okay? The answer is within you. It's inside of you, okay? And I feel like you have to quiet your mind in order to hear it. I'm saying that because you have the owl and you have that crow there, which makes me feel like there is a lot of wisdom that is already inside of you, okay? And a lot of things that you can tap into, you have the tower card here, here in reverse. So there's some change coming, okay? Um, some complications that may have happened already or is going to be happening for some of you Virgos here with it in reverse. So I feel like this has already happened, okay? Whatever this is, is conflict, is frustration. Um, with this tower card, you have the eight of pentacles here in reverse. It's a lack of commitment by someone um, in love, okay? You're being asked to commit to yourself here, uh, Virgo, to listen um, to your own advice at this moment. Because I feel like a message will be coming in towards you. You've been looking for answers, okay? Or a way to see the situation or this obstacle in another way, okay? Yeah, I felt like it was about heartbreak. So this is a period of recovery for you. And I feel like... You will start getting the help that you need. And I feel like it's more on a emotional basis that you're going to get this assistance, Okay. To recover from heartbreak to try to move on from being lonely I feel like you guys are being 
you're being led to connect with people, okay? Some of my Virgos are feeling detached right now emotionally. And I feel like you're almost turning yourself into an introvert somewhat, okay? Not being social, okay? Um, and turning inward and, and not so much of a good way okay if you're going to turn inward turn inward to get the answers that you're looking for so that you can move forward in your path okay i'm saying oh whew, excuse me guys i just belched i'm saying that because i see the eight of pentacles here uh in reverse someone's getting tired okay they're ready to throw in the towel right now they feel like they're wasting their time they're bored as hell they're ready for something to be over with that's already dead, okay? Um, that they feel like they are just ready to um, move on from. They're like, okay, already. Let's go. Let's let's move this process along. Let's move this. Let's see some progress here, okay? I feel like there is a little bit too much grief and it may be consuming you at this time okay that's why there's a lot of prayers going up and that's what i'm saying right now okay you're being told to look at this situation through the eyes of love rather than fear take it as a lesson okay and continue to move on in your path yeah continue to move on your path all right there's something better that is coming towards you guys i feel like this situation ended um in a way because it needed to things were being rearranged for you blocks were being removed out of your way and i felt like i feel like you were holding on to something that was destined to change okay so the change is either coming or it came already in this relationship for my Virgos, okay? That was deep. So, and a little confusing. Let's go. Let's go and see what your career is looking like. So Pandora's box. You got it, okay? There's no shame in your learning process. Don't be ashamed of what you're going through, okay? Um ask the questions okay break free from negative criticism negative people um and negative power games or just power games in general okay find your own light within yourself here Vir virgo and get ready for this shift this shift that has already happened or the shift that is about to occur okay within yourself within your life and in your career okay and when i say in your life it's your career and your love here that we're looking at okay but i feel like you'll have an opportunity to really show your creative side once you open this um <laughs> open yourself up open this pandora's box you're being asked to stretch your soul stuff okay and find your life your light within this shift let's take a look and see what's going on here what messages do you have for Virgo? What messages do you have for Virgo? You have the Eight of Wands here in reverse. Somebody is jealous. You got some jealous people of you at work, okay? That do not want to give you opportunities i feel like they what's going on may be somewhat negative and may create setbacks here okay this is a learning process whatever you're going through in your job here okay that's why you have the pandora's gift there okay yeah they're not showing the love with the page of cups here in reverse somebody's being very negative negative nancy's over sensitive overly sensitive people um 
I just feel like there is a lot of emotions flying, okay? That's what I'm feeling here. So you're going to be bringing in some change here. Um, yeah, I feel like you will be bringing in some change here with this card. But you're going to have to learn from it. Some of you guys are going to be breaking free from this situation. Okay. Trying to break free from negativity. And I feel like it's pissing you off. It's making you very upset. And you're ready to go through this type of transformation. Okay. Or this transition. All right. In your life. So that you can bring in something new here. All right. So... There's no shame in your learning process here. Ask the questions that you need to ask here, Virgo. Break free from negativity, negative people, okay, negative uh, situations and power games. People that just want to be over you, don't want to show you love, don't want to give you opportunity. Um, where it creates, I feel like someone may have apply for a position and got denied for it okay with this page of pentacles in reverse that's what i'm feeling here it's like yeah someone was overly critical of you or just plain fucking jealous of you okay that's what that was all right don't worry about that i feel like you have something better coming up here in june keep grinding it out here um virgo believe in yourself and like this car said, strut your soul stuff, okay? I love you guys. Take care of yourself. Like, subscribe, and share this video for me. Give me a thumbs up on the video. Hit the notification bell. I'll be back with you soon. Take care, loves. Bye.